Partition Manager is advanced module of Active and Delete, designed to initialize new hard disk, create new partition, format or change attribute of existing partition, resize or delete existing volume, and more. To launch Partition Manager, select Tools and Partition Manager command in menu bar, or use keyboard shortcut by pressing Ctrl and M keys. I would like to show you how to create new partition on allocated space on one of my hard drives. To create new partition, select an allocated space and then click Create New Partition button in Toolbar or right-click on an allocated space and then select Create New Partition command from Context menu. In the Create New Partition dialog, select Partition Geometry by entering Offset and Size, Optional Partition Attributes, Volume Label and Formatting Attributes if needed. For demonstration purposes, I will create partition about half size of my unallocated space available, leaving other options intact and not selecting partition formatting for a moment. So now I have a newly created partition over here, but as long as it's not formatted to any file system, there is nothing I can do about it. So to format this newly created partition, I will select it first, then click Format button in Toolbar, or use Context menu Format command. In this dialog you can select Label for Created Volume, select File System for instance NTFS, leaving Allocated Unit Size as a default, and click Format to begin formatting. Confirm. And now when formatting completed, you'll have a new volume named Label 1 and saying it's uh, NTFS partition if you check out the properties over here. To demonstrate volume resize feature, I put some files on our newly created volume to use about half of its size. To resize existing volume, select it first and then click Resize button in Toolbar or use Resize command from Context menu. Partition map on resize volume dialog shows use space, space available, and unallocated space located right behind of existing volume. You can also see three options here. The first one is to upsize the existing volume to use all unallocated space which is right behind this volume. The second option is to shrink down the volume to reduce its size to minimum space available. And finally, the third option is to enter a custom volume size. You can also drag the sliding bar to specify any desired volume size. For this example, I will upsize this volume to use all space available. To do so, I will select first option and then click Resize button to execute. Done. As you can see now, this volume is using all the space available in the area of this hard disk drive. So, resizing volume, or also known as partitions, can be useful in organizing the volumes on your hard disk drive. That's it about essential features of Partition Manager model of Active at and Delete. To find out more about Partition Manager, please visit our website and download Active at and Delete demo for free. Thank you for watching this video. Until next time.